Hello once again and welcome to Angel's Review for the Halo Pearl. You might be noticing a trend by now recently of Angel and I seeing the same results from the last several balls, but here's where we're going to differ a bit. Where I leave the occasional 10 with the HP and would have to throw it very terribly for it to blow through the breakpoint, it was a bit weaker for Angel than we both expected. This wasn't necessarily a bad thing as a couple board moved to the right, put her back in the pocket, but contradictory to me, the Idle Pearl actually seemed to be stronger for her than the Halo Pearl. Since they share the same cover stock and the Halo Pearl is asymmetric, the numbers and mass say that the Halo Pearl should be stronger, but for Angel, the Halo Pearl is actually longer and a bit rounder. Now, oddly enough, I found the same to be true from my comparison of the Halo to the Idol. The Halo was actually longer and smoother than the Idol and slightly weaker. Now, like the Idol Pearl, though, Angel had a lot of fun throwing this one. She had no issue getting it down the lane, and once she adjusted back to the right a bit, no issue getting it to the pocket, which was something we both experienced. It's so comfortable to throw, it's just the prototypical asymmetric pearl. Easy length, strong move down lane, and very consistent. Now, Comparing to the idle pearl, you can see the more aggressive move down lane and stronger response to friction for her idle pearl for some reason. It's not what the numbers say, but it is what it is, and ball reaction is king as always. Always pay attention to the ball reaction. But for how different the cover formulas are, the Halo and Halo Pearl are very familiar shapes, and the Halo Pearl is a wonderful complement to the Halo. The Halos and Idols are a couple of the best ball combinations out there right now, if not the best. Angel is naturally a bigger fan of the Pearls. The Solids are just too strong for her slower speed most of the time. If you already have an Idol Pearl, you might have a little hook overlap, but they are different shapes, and it's also a good complement to the Hypercell Fused. The Halo Pearl is a great look for any style of bowler on medium to medium heavy conditions, and I don't think I really need to talk it up. You can see for yourself how good it looks for both of us. Thanks for watching. Hey, <laughs> <laughs>